After an operation, most patients don't come back to their doctors for around 14 days or later for their first post-operative checkup. Wounds show signs of infection before this time point. If caught early, infections can be treated with antibiotics and specific wound care, minimizing wound complications and morbidity. If these wound ailments are not caught early, many problems can arise. 1. Surgical site complications such as surgical site infections lead to additional costs for patients, insurers, and providers. 2. Surgeons spend a lot of time documenting wounds, and that is required for billing. This is valuable time that can be spent taking care of patients. 3. Surgical compliance is low. For proper recovery, patients need to follow the post-operative procedures provided to them. And finally, 4. This is perhaps the most important. Better diagnosis of wound afflictions guarantees better wound care, minimizing wound complications and morbidity. My solution to this problem is Thea. Automated post-operative compliance management and wound assessment through convolutional neural networks. The first component of the application is quick test. This is a simple way to screen wounds quickly and get results from our deep learning based server. Simply take an image of your wound and it will be sent to the server right away where it's analyzed and within 10 seconds, the results will be provided back to you within the app. From here, you can easily export a PDF which contains the values that the deep learning network found and you can send it to family or your physician. The second component of the app is the ability to add wounds. There's a simple form-based interface to add wounds where you provide information about your doctor, a little bit about yourself, as well as an image of the wound. This information is then taken and sent to our server, where it is analyzed once again for any ailments that your wound may currently possess. Once the wound is submitted and saved onto your local device, you can tap on it and take care of any compliance management that you need to take care of, such as tracking your medicine or your exercise. This is another key component of the application. You can simply tap the plus or minus signs to indicate how much medication or exercise you have taken that day. Furthermore, every day there's a daily assessment that you can take in where you take a picture of the wound, your current weight, as well as your current pain. This information is stored onto your device and over time it creates a cumulative wound report for that surgical wound. Although exercise as well as medication don't directly correlate with wound infections, there are key metrics which physicians can use to assess the recovery of patients. The final component of the application is Connect. We've provided a simple to use interface to easily contact your surgeon or doctor via message, email, or phone call. Finally, you can export a comprehensive wound report that displays the progress of your wound as an easy to read PDF, which can then be shared with your family or physician. But how does this all work? The answer to that question is deep learning, a new powerful technology that is extremely good at classifying images. Deep learning is both part of the broader picture of artificial intelligence and machine learning. These are essentially techniques which computer scientists and mathematicians have been building to help computers understand subject matter at the level that humans can, such as being able to comprehend images and text. Here are some examples of deep learning. You can train a neural network on images of handwritten text and then predict other images of handwritten text from that gained knowledge. Some applications of machine and deep learning include melanoma diagnosis for skin cancer, playing the board game Go, self-driving cars, as well as translating text from one language to another. Through deep learning, Thea is able to understand what afflictions are currently present in a wound. From a simple image, which is then split into its RGB channels and then sent through WoundNet, Thea can understand what is currently in that wound, generating a clean wound report. For example, for surgical site infection, Thea scores an accuracy of 78%, as well as an ROC AUC of 0.87, which stands for a Receiver Operating Characteristic Area Under Curve. We use a couple of tools to develop our app. On the front end, we use the Swift programming language with the Xcode Integrated Development Environment, or IDE. We use the Sketch design software to effectively design the user interface for our app. For our backend, we use the Python 3.6 programming language on an AWS EC2 instance 
with the Tesla K80 GPU for running all of our deep learning software. Thanks to Thea, now rather than having patients come back to the hospital every few days, instead they can take pictures of their wounds every single day and deliver their reports to their physician. Now, if the physician does notice something unusual within the wound, they can just call the patient over at that particular instance. This saves time and money for everyone. It solves an important problem currently present in the healthcare industry through a novel technology, deep artificial neural networks. Furthermore, Thea boasts an elegant and immersive user experience and interface, which makes it easier for both the doctors and patients to use. Thank you for watching. You can learn more about Thea at varunshnoi.com slash Thea. Finally, I'd like to provide a special thank you to a couple of people. One, Professor Oliver Alami from Stanford University for initiating the research as well as providing me with technical medical assistance whenever I need it during the development of the deep learning algorithm and mobile application. Two, Lauren Alami for collecting data from patients and enrolling them into the program. And finally, Elizabeth Foster for cleaning, cropping, and labeling the images which are used to train and test the deep learning algorithm.